Alright, we're back online. Hello YouTube and welcome to the second part of my Rogue State playthrough. And what best way to start if not by telling a joke? So let's call this guy. Hello chicken man. Thank you for I would like to tell you a joke. Two hunters are out in the woods. One of them collapses. He doesn't seem to be breathing, so the other hunter pulls out his cell phone and calls emergency services. He cries out to the operator, My friend is dead! What can I do? The operator says, Calm down, I can help. First, let's make sure he's dead. There is silence, then a gunshot is heard. Back on the phone, the hunter says, Okay, now what? <laughs> Very funny. Tough crowd. Okay, now let's get back to the serious stuff. Uh, do I really need to tell anything to this guy? Old ways? Do you like the old ways? Yeah, he certainly does not like the new ways where you eat chicken, so... Imperialism. Do you like imperialism? Western imperialism? Uh, old ways. We protect the old ways. We think they are important, but not that much, or... Yeah, let's go this way. Spiritual leadership? Yeah, theology is best left to the priests. Okay. Do you like imperialism? You don't like imperialism. Do you like KFC? We are very worried about... Yeah, you don't like KFC. I was sure you didn't like it. Okay, do we need to trade anything for you? Uh, metals? No way. Goats. Goats. Um... Yeah, no thanks. Apologies, but I must go. Let us speak. Okay, this was a good call, actually. <laughs> I actually got a few things right. So, before you continue, let's have a look at our, our country is. Okay, so, our support is green, and this is great. As you can see, the liberals don't really like me because it's my previous policies. But uh, with green support, that is like a cumulative stuff that I got from like uh, these two here, homeless shelters and uh, disabled services, rents, I, I got them to actually have good support, so yeah, they, we, I am actually starting to gain my liberals again. GDP is still quite low, how can I increase my GDP? This is already at maximum. Actually, I shouldn't spend that much in my schools. UN relations. Do UN like me? I guess they do. Uh... Okay, normal schools, I guess. We already have green support, so we'll try. We should try to cut some costs here and earn more money per turn. So let's put it right here. Like, okay, transports, I guess. And we have these right here. Okay, I'm not increasing, but uh, not increasing support. But as long as I don't lose support, it will remain green, and these guys will keep liking me. Fundamentalist and liberal approval. Okay. So what else should we do right now? This is good. This is good as well. Yeah, I'm losing labor rights, but as I said, I can't really do anything about this, it's... I know, Marx wouldn't really like me for this, but I can't really do have good labor rights in this game. Uh, it's just not doable. I can't really please the liberals this way. But at least I give them good support, so yeah, you have good schools, eh, somewhat good schools, I guess. Good transports, eh, somewhat good transports, I guess. So, should we increase that penalty? That? Nah, we shouldn't. This we shouldn't as well. Crime is green too, so I'll say we're fine here. Yeah, we're losing patriots. Yeah, let's put this right here. This way I can please patriots at least somewhat. And uh, not upset capitalists. What should I put right here? No foreign workers. Okay, I'll lose capitalists slowly, but it's okay, I guess. Yeah, let's leave it like this. 
Yeah, and we're good for now, I guess. Okay, we changed a few policies. I don't really have enough money to build anything, like 28 million is quite bad. Yeah, I know, working conditions are very poor. Let's have a look at our treasury. Okay, one thing that you are supposed to do is actually put some money in your uh, Liechtenstein account. <laughs> But yeah, it, it this increases the, the score at the end of the game, but I don't really want to do this. So yeah, I think I have done enough for now. I should start gaining liberals soon. Well, let's have a look at something else. I want to see my parliament. 64, 40, 53. Mm, this is not very good, but there's not really much I can do. I need to wait until these guys ask me for uh, some missions or something. Uh, I would like to have this guy better here, the foreign relations, because if I had, I could build, um, I could build this, the oil pipeline, and also this, I could sell weapons to my, to my, uh, my neighborhoods, and I would earn a few. 2 million per turn and improve their relation but for that I need 65 relations with my foreign minister and I don't have that I have just 40 so okay uh, one more thing I remember that we should do let's have a look at our strategic overview and uh, okay we don't really need these troops right here this was done for a mission so let's move this to Karlsharra Let's move these guys to the chicken dudes. Chicken instant. Chicken instant. And let's put, put these guys inland. Okay, we're good. Let's finally check this guy here. 85%. So there's just 15% chance that we mess this up, I really hope that doesn't happen. Okay, we're done. Excellency, our accountants revealed that we actually have 200 more! 200 million more, let's execute them! Execute them. No. Okay, this is actually a very good event, you know, and uh, it doesn't happen that often, but I got uh, two, more 200. And this is really good. This gives you some room so I can build more infrastructure. Okay, let's build these guys here. Riot police. Okay, I want to avoid as much as possible these ones that have a recurring cost, so I'm not building these right now. And what else do we have? Uh, no, I'm not going to build any of these. Neither these, I guess. Uh, yeah, this is recurring cost. This is if I want to make my fundamentalists like me, I can go for this path. But I'm okay with fundamentalists, so I'd say we're good. Let's just have a look here. Yeah, the game broke a little. Okay, it's unbroken. And. Okay, this one I won't do right now, because I need to wait until my trade agreement ends. Okay, I checked that the goats are inexpensive at the moment. I could get this, but I don't really need it, I guess. You know, if I talk to the chicken dude, but let's not. Okay, well, I actually, actually guess I'm gonna wait until something happens. Foreign video games are seeking funds to, from your treasury to start working a game detailing the Great Revolution and your installation as a glorious leader of the People's Republic. Should I give them money or not? Uh, patriots, but less fundamentalists? Have them arrested. More fundamentalists, less liberals. Effect liberals, I guess. Okay, what does this guy want? Move one unit to Shikanistan. Yeah, why not? Let's 
let's go. Uh, let's move these guys. No, these guys from Kalshara, since Kalshara likes us to Shikanista. Okay, this will earn us a favor from our minister. Okay, should we do anything else at the moment? Let's have a look at our policies again. Crap, I really want more GDP. Crap. What else can I get more GDP for? Here. Okay, I'll need to have a look on my crime, but as long as I can keep this green, I should be able to move this right here. Also, since I got some money from the previous turns, I'll actually get this here. And since I use a lot of public transportation, I am going to give them good uh, trains and uh, buses and whatever. Crime, corruption, low corruption, this is good. Okay. Don't move anything else. We're still earning 18 million per turn. Identifying as capitalists. Okay, good. Let's end this turn. A preeminent, femini preeminent feminist group is asking that Amir Yusuf, a famous Bazenji composer, uh, be replaced with a famous Bazenji female scientist. The Amir Yusuf has featured the note over 17 years, so his removal will no doubt accept. Bezenji traditionalists, but recent studies will have revealed that an uh, 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 So, should we appoint a woman? Or not? I'm gonna get more liberals and less patriots, and here. Ah, uh, yeah, why not? I have a lot of patriot support. So. Yeah. Less patriots, more liberals. Okay. It's hard to please liberals, as I said, but why not? War was broken out between two of our neighbors. Okay, I already know. Okay, this guy liked that what I did. So... 25 million. Nice. Okay. I'm earning loyalty points. This is... Uh, this is very important. If I have 100, any surplus that I'll get will go here, to banked loyalty points. And I would say that the most important things that I get with these banked loyalty points are these three stuffs right here. I don't want to go to war with anyone. If I can, I'm going to have this a peaceful game. And uh, if I click any of these, my relation with whatever faction I support uh, I select will increase and this is very important this one is this one's here I can uh, I can click here to, to earn approval approval for for all different factions and uh, yeah this four here and here gives me a free tank but I still have to pay for their upkeep so it's not that good I guess and 80 points is quite a lot so how do I earn points? As long as I do a good job ruling Bazenji, I will earn points every turn. Uh, 8 loyalty points means I'm doing a good job, the parliament supports me, you know? Uh, and I get this with good public opinion. So I guess this game is going good. So should we build anything right now? Regional Loma. Yeah, I can try to host peace talks so they don't go to war together. I don't know if I if I earn anything about by clicking this, um, but yeah, should I have them have peace with each other or not? I don't really know. Yeah, let's have peace. Ah, uh, crap! So I can't do this. Uh, I want a good foreign minister, he's actually so important, but I'm earning approval every turn. This guy is capitalist, and since capitalists like me, I'm earning approval with him. I need to wait until it's 65. So... This will be actually a good time to place some money in my extra bank account. Nah, we're not gonna do that. 
we're gonna be good present you know good good present so what's happening university students are boldly campaigning on the, in the streets for the government that support laws that prohibit discrimination against same sex couples our country's fundamentalists will be watching our re response closely uh, I can upset my fundamentalists, I can upset them a little, or I can just don't care about this. You know, I'm gonna answer this as boldly campaigning in the streets for the government to support laws that prohibit discrimination. Uh, Let's upset them a little. I don't really care that people have with the same sex have sex or whatever. So let's lose a little bit of fundamentalists. What does this guy want? Three additional units to Shikenish town. Yeah, okay. Wait, additional? Uh, that's not good. He wants five units here. Three additional units. I'm gonna try something else. I'm gonna remove this guy to Kalshara, and then I'm removing this guy to Akinstan. Hey, I have a really bad relation with these guys. That's not good. Um, now let's move this to Shikenistan and this to Shikenistan. And now. Oh crap, I shouldn't have done this. I want to cheese this guy. Three additional units. So I removed two. And I'm gonna... Procurement officer. I'm gonna hire these guys. Okay. And I'm gonna deploy them in Chikenistan. And see if it's enough. Chikenistan. Okay. We're done here. I'm going also to try to give a call to the other guy, to the priest guy. So I'll try to Thank make my relations good again. Issues. Speed light or is it? No, no. Once more, can you Do you like United States? Yeah, I don't really know. Okay, I can't click this. Oh, wait, I can. This guy looks like a priest he looks like a priest but he's not a priest yes Spirit. we believe that theology is better left to the priests I guess that's not a bad answer uh, do you like United States or not I don't really remember I should have paid more attention to my first call to this guy uh, crap you like United States. We are interested in joint. We would welcome any assistance yes, you could join. Yes, you like offer, United States. Particularly in our financial sector. Okay, now let's trade. Oh. Okay, I have an idea. These his goods are very cheap at the moment. And I'm gonna get uh, re good relations with, with United States if I have oil in my country. And I guess I earn liberals if I buy this thing from this guy. So let's try... Wait, but my relations with this guy are not good at the moment, so he's gonna charge me. Crap, whatever. Interested. Certainly. Seven million. Okay, I'm gonna pay. This is not good, but whatever. Okay, and you're gonna buy oil. <laughs> Trade. Buy oil. Yeah, interest certainly. Ten million. <sighs> this is really not very good. <sighs> but again, I have a lot of money at the moment, so I'm not really that worried about spending money on this guy here. Apologies, so let's hand the call. But that goodbye. Yeah. Okay. An unstable schizophrenic has tried to kill me! Oh, good thing they, the palace guard stopped this guy before, before he hurt me or my family. Oh, what 
a destruir. Ok, my trade agreement with Kalshara has expired. Now it's time for me to check something. I need to go... Where is it? Here? No, not here, crap. Um, yeah, this didn't work. I need to hire actually additional units. Crap. Uh, I want to go... Where is it? Here. I want to see which what is the what is the current price of my goods. So I produce metal. Metal is good actually. I'm not going to try to boost it or whatever. And uh, I have plastics. Plastics is great. Okay. I I had to check this because as I said earlier uh, in my previous video. I said I would probably buy this thing here because this increases uh, my goods, my goods value. But they are actually pretty good at the moment, so I don't really see a reason to do that right now. We'll may do it just later. And we are buying electronics from Kalshara as well. We are buying electronics because we want these. So yeah, let's just uh, call this guy again. Kalshara and let's start some new thank trades. you for okay uh, trades have like like a limit duration it just expires okay so I have to trade with him again so let's trade I want to sell you my plastic are you in taking into 25 million great this is really good now I want to sell you my precious metals. Are you interested? Taking into account more twenty-two. Great. Okay, now we can purchase their garments or their electronics. But damn, their electronics are so expensive at the moment. I don't really know if I want to do this. But then again. I don't really have that much of a financial trouble at the moment. I might have later. I'm gonna need later all the cash I, I can, I can have. But yeah, whatever. We are interested. Taking in seventeen million. Ouch! This hurts. Should we do this or not? Yeah, whatever. This was it was a mistake. But whatever, whatever. All for my glorious Goodbye. people of Bazenji. I'm a very benevolent president, I guess. Okay, this one is not updated, so don't worry. It will just change soon. Let's have a look here. I have to fulfill this guy's request if I want. And I guess I want. And uh, my policies. Yeah, this is all green. Good. Perfect. Except this, but whatever, as I said, I can't really have that. So let's move this one right here. And... Should we do anything else? GDP, UN relations. My UN relations are good at the moment, so let's remove some funding from schools. I'm still gonna leave this because, as I said, I take public transportation like every day, so... I would want that my government offered me good transportation, so I'm gonna leave this thing here. I think about my citizens, you know? Okay, this one, I can change it, so it uh, changes... Yeah, but I don't want more crime. Or should I? Okay, let's make our, our try to make our liberals happy. Okay, this one is good, you know, 100% support from patriots and capitalists, and this is okay, I guess. It's close to zero, 1%, good. If it was negative one, it would be okay as well, so we leave it like that. You know, our trade agreements also help with, with uh, this thing here, you know. So I'd say let's leave things like that. Okay, now we need to please the other stupid dude that wants me to units to, to 
Sushikenistan. It's Sushikenistan, right? I need to check again, but let's first hire them. Procurement officer. Crap, this is not good. One, two, let's spend a crap lot of cash. I already spent it, now I need to check where this guy wanted, I guess it was in Shikenistan, but I forgot. Where do you guys want the troops? Yeah, you want me to troop, move the troops to the Shikan dude. I guess I could cheese it after all. So let's move this to Shikenistan. And this to Shikenistan too. I guess we are earning some relations with this guy. It was a good call. Okay, we're done. Fundamentalist cleric are calling upon the government to prohibit luxury goods and denounce conspicuous consumption. I can earn fundamentalists or lose them. Should I upset capitalists? I shouldn't, but uh, still, it's... You know, I agree with this thing. Prohibit luxury goods and denounce conspicuous consumption. Yeah, we want a more like green society and, uh, and uh, I hate capitalism. Yeah! Ah, oh, crap, this was not good. <laughs> okay, let's leave it like that. Okay, I know. I earned this favor from this guy. What are you going to give me? 15 approval from capitalists. Yeah, you see? That's how you do it. But I'm actually not going to use it yet. Because my cap capitalists like me. It's like 90%. So, policies. So, yeah, it's close to 100. I can actually save that card that the, that guy gave me. Like this favor here. You know? And that is a, it's actually, it's actually what, what I'm gonna do. So let's save it. So... I want to check something. Let's check how is this going. 89%! Yes! You know, every time I click like clandestine operations, I can check how things are going. And this is actually going very good. So... 89%. Great. Let's talk to this guy here. How Do they love me? If you don't mind me saying, yes. The troops love you. They will follow your orders faithfully. Okay, we're done. Thanks. I want to remove troops from the chicken dudes. They like me, so I want to put them in in Akinstam, just in case they decide to attack me. Probably won't, but whatever. And these guys go inland. And uh, I can't move these guys because they're still redeploying, so let's leave it like that at the moment. And we're done. A resolution is anticipated in Renana condemning Russia from the evasion of a neighbor or her state. You have been approached by the Russian ambassador requesting that you vote down to the resolution. Doing so will put us out of alignment with our neighborhoods in the region. Should I vote with this uh, or lose relations with anyone lose relations with everyone yeah so these guys declare war me okay this russian things that i'm being asked for is actually a chain of events i have done this before if i always vote for our for russia they give me protection so i can't be invaded by my by these three guys here but I think I still lose to the United States if I lose all relation. I'm not quite sure about this, but yeah. Um, I don't really care about Russians. We don't need their protection. So I'm gonna earn some relations with the United States. Okay, I was also wanted to show you something else. You see, buying stuff from my neighbors is expensive, and because of that I'm only earning 1 million per turn, which is almost like nothing. This is pretty much a statement, I'm not earning any money. But I'm waiting for the 
for the dam to finish, so I should earn like 50 million or something like that when it's done. And uh, well, because of our trade agreements, we're earning a few stuff here that helps uh, my people so they become happier. I'm earning capitalist, capitalist, patriot, and patriot and liberal. No, wait. Plus one liberal when imported. So uh, when this, this one does not apply, this one does apply. So, yeah, let's leave it like that. I don't really need to do anything else, I, I'd say. So let's enter. An invasive species of oryx are taking over large uh, swaths of land. As you well know, a single oryx can produce eggs for thousands of uh, African antelopes. Import Bengal tigers, upset our neighbors, do nothing. Yeah, let's import tigers to eat those oryx. Yeah, this is actually so good. This is going all green. This game is really going very, very well at the moment. These guys like me, except I neither this guy to like me, but I'm not. So he's not. I'm earning a few points, so if I see that I'm losing a lot of relations with any of our neighbors, I can just click here. So I guess I don't really need to do anything. Let's skip this turn. An American drone strike appears to have killed the leader of an insurgency group in the mountain region, but also harmed several bystanders. The group accuses your regime of concluding with the Americans by attacking your own people. I can improve relations with Akinstan. I can praise the Americans. I can spend 40 million to... Yeah, I still have room to lose a relation with the United States. So let's improve our relation with Akinstan. Yeah, okay. I'm buying oil, so I earn relations with them. War was broken out, I know, they are at war. And... Yeah, let's not do anything. Skip turn. A small asteroid will hit but Zenji in 18 hours. We cannot assess exactly where it will land, but the shockwave is likely to cause some injuries. Oh, crap. This will destroy something. It's like a negative event, I guess. If I had... Uh, like this project on, I could deflect the asteroid, <laughs> but I can't do that. So what did it destroy? Nothing. Nothing, I guess. Great. Great, 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 great. So... Let's just have a look here. See, see if everything is still green. Yes, yes. Okay. You know, let's actually try to not lose more labor. <laughs> let's try to keep it red. It's, this is actually orange, it goes even redder, red, redder. So... Let's enter. Gun ownership is highly restricted in Bazenji. A local organization is petitioning the government to relax these measures. No, let's not give them weapons. Yes, let's earn money. <laughs> okay, I wouldn't really do this if if I was actually, you know, the president of my country and, or the dictator of my country, and uh, you know, I don't want, I wouldn't want to have citizens having guns. But since this is just a game, I'm gonna, I'm gonna click here. Because of that other income plus, I'm uh, taxing the sales of those weapons. I will upset the liberals, but whatever. Okay. Uh, I don't like my, my relations with Akinstam, so let's improve our relations with Akinstam. These guys here. We're good. Now let's just check how our, how our relation is. It's, it hasn't improved yet, but it should improve next turn, I guess. Enter. Some Basenjis, in particular to Karif province, chew a tree sap resin known as Bush Tachash. 
as a part of ancient, ancient social custom. Bush sash is a milled opiate that induces euphoria and excitement that is legal in most Africa and Middle East. New evidence indicates that Bush sash uh, may be more harmful for consumption than previously believed, linking into certain cancers, cancers and birth defects. So, should I ban the consumption of this drug? Or should I legalize it? Or should I legal regulate uh, production? Or do I use drugs? <laughs> this is really very good. Okay, you see this plus carry fee? Okay, I haven't talked about uh, I haven't talked about it until now. But the part of my of my population if, is like uh, ethnic carafi carafi. It's like their et ethnicity. And I believe they're like fundamentalists, and uh, and yeah, I'm actually gonna not gonna do this because I don't want to upset the carry carry fee. Later in the game, uh, they will actually try to have a referendum. I guess it doesn't doesn't happen in every game, but can happen. These guys can try to have a referendum to leave my country, and that, this is not good. I don't want these guys to leave my country. It uh, it reduces my chance of winning, actually winning the game. So I'm gonna vote this. I'm gonna say that I use this opiate, so my Karafi likes me. Yeah. Okay, now let's talk to our people. The honorable Basenji people, my fellow countrymen and women. My beloved citizens, Second try. I address can we you do today better than first time? We are ushering in a new era in the history of our homeland. I wish to address you first, as you are the owners of this blessed land, its defenders, the builders of its prosperity, and the architects of its future. Okay. Earlier I tried here, but I'm not gonna click this, because this is actually trying to please my liberals. And it's just so hard to please the liberals, so I'm not gonna do that. This one will uh, improve relations with patriots, but actually I have 100 relations with everyone, so I guess it doesn't accept liberals, so I guess it doesn't really matter what I click. I'm gonna click... I don't know what I'm gonna click. It's not that important after all, I guess. So... Let's talk about the glorious revolution. Our glorious revolution. revolution marked the day that we established our independence and our national identity. Okay. Now let's talk about more about revolution, I guess. No. No, I'm not going to subsidize anything. I'm not going to increase the funds. Uh, just one plus, but it has to do with the first statement, so... Wait, new education credits? I have to pay? No way. A new branch. Click here. Second, we'll commit to new ground. No. No. Uh, uh, capitalists, uh, sovereignty, here. Second, finally. Yeah, three pluses. I look and didn't work again. Failed. Well, but it was still much better at the first try, so... Yeah, we almost made it. It's getting better. Okay, so I had my second speech. I'll say that this is actually a good bar... a good... Uh, a good moment to start uh, to, like, end this video. I think you have already seen what's going on in, like, 13. Yeah, it's... It's about half an hour of video, or even more than that, I guess, so it's enough for now. And yeah, I hope you are enjoying it. enjoying it. I'll see you later for the third part, I guess, so I guess uh, see you later. Thank you for watching, and bye-bye.